Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to make this video. This is actually a video that I wanted to make last night uh, while I was in my quiet time, but I was in my quiet time, so I didn't make it, but I actually jotted it down in my notes because it was so powerful to me. And I think this can speak to somebody that's going through a really, really tough time right now. But yeah, I was listening, I was in my quiet time and I was listening to some worship music and one of my favorite gospel artists is Smokey Norfolk. Um, and he, one of my, one of, he has two of my favorite songs. So my first favorite song by him is called Dear God. And my second favorite song by him is called Forever Yours. And that song brings me to tears every single time. It never gets old. I played that song out back to back to back over and over and over a million times and it never gets old. So yeah, check it out by Smokey Norful. It's called Forever Yours. And when I heard that song, I just broke down into tears. And I'm going to tell you why. I tend to go to that song whenever I'm going through a tough time. But yesterday, I felt like I was in such a good place. I, I just, I wanted to listen to that song. And as I'm listening to that song, it just, I just had like this flash of, all those times that I was going through really, really painful things. And I felt like it was something I could never heal from, or it was something that I could never get through, or I'd never see the end, that, that light at the end of the tunnel. You know, when you're going through a really painful time and people tell you like, it'll get better, you know, this is, this season is temporary. Sometimes you don't want to hear that or you don't believe it because the pain is so real to you that you feel like this pain is never going to go away. This pain is never going to heal. And so as I'm listening to that song, I'm just, I was thinking about that, like, man, the last time I listened to this song, you know, I'm watching videos, I'm listening to word, to the word, and I keep hearing things are going to get better, and it just didn't feel like it. And I felt at that time that all I could do was listen to that song and cry, just cry out to God, because I couldn't think of anything else to do. And I remember times where I've cried out to God, like, man, just take me now, you know, and I'm not suicidal or anything, but you know how you just get, you just get tired and you just like, Lord, just, I'm done. Like, I'm done. I throw my hands up. I'm done. And I would just cry to that song. And so for me to be listening to that song yesterday in a good place and worshiping out of just overflow and just feeling blessed and how good God has been to me, even though I don't deserve it, I was just overwhelmed with tears, but these were different tears. And I never knew the same song that would bring me so much pain I would be listening to from like uh, a good place, a place of being healed. So I just I just wanted to share that with you. If you're going through something right now and you just feel like, man, this pain ain't never going to end. I'm never going to get through this. Like this is just that one thing in life like I, I, I can't get over. I can't get through. You can get through. There is a brighter day, you know, and this is for anybody that may be going through, um, you know, financial hardships, you're going through a loss, you're going through um, heartbreak, um, you just lost everything you worked for. I know how painful those things can be because I've been through all of that and I'm here now, you know, and not to say that you'll just be completely over it and completely healed i feel like even while we're healed there's always still a small part of us that that um you know still hurts or you you know you still feel for a certain situation but you're able to just push through it you able to see that light at the end of the tunnel you actually are able to see like your life moving forward being better and not so dark but yeah, man, I just I just went through some really, really dark times. And when I just looked at where I am or where I was yesterday and even today, I was just overwhelmed because I'm like, man, God, I remember crying out to you, not knowing how I was going to make it to the next day, didn't want to make it to the next day. And, you know, you just wake up with like this achy feeling in your heart that just feels like it's never going to go away. And trust me when I tell you it's going to go away. If you want to be healed, cry out to God, you know, listen to that song. I'm telling you, listen to that song. Those lyrics just do something to me. Sometimes music, that's the point of worshiping too. Not only to bring glory to God, but sometimes, you know, them those songs speak what your mouth can't speak, but what your soul is aching to say, and you just don't know how to put it into words. So yeah, again, it's Smokey Norful. 
um, forever yours. And uh, also listen to Smokey Norfolk's Dear God because that's an, that those those songs are neck and neck. I tend to listen to those back to back when I'm going through something. So um, so yeah, you're gonna get through it. You're going to get over it. How you feel today, your heart is deceptive. How you feel today is not how you're going to feel tomorrow. And if you do feel like that tomorrow or you feel like, man, I, I just been feeling like this deep hurt for months. This is this, this for months. Like this feels like it's never going to end. It's never going to go away. It's going to go. It's going to go away. But also to add on to that. You have to be proactive about your healing, too. Sometimes we can get caught in a slump and we get caught up in this woe is me. At some point, you got to pick yourself up and you got to want to heal. Sometimes we get comfortable with that victim mentality. You know what I mean? Like, well, I'm the victim and I was done wrong. You know, sometimes we get comfortable in that and and we and we're hurting, but you got to want to heal. You got to want to do the work and you got to know the work is not going to be easy. There's no shortcut through pain. You got to go through it. You got to go through it. But just know you're going to look back on your life and be like, dang, I'm, I, I've gotten so much stronger. Like those things that I thought were going to literally kill me because I was praying to God, just take me like I'm tired. I'm tired. Like those very things have made me strong. And now I can speak to somebody else going through the same thing or going through that season currently now. And I can look at them in all honesty and wholeheartedly and say, you're going to get through it. You're going to make it through. This pain is not going to last forever. Don't trust your heart. Don't trust your feelings. You got to fight for your healing. You got to fight to want to wanna feel good. Nothing's going to come easy. You're going to have to do those hard things you don't want to do. And you got to start feeding your mind with positive things like that worship music. Even though I was crying to it, eventually it started to help me heal as well. And now that same song I can smile to and, and cry happy tears and be so joyful and actually want to live and want God's will for my life you know the 360 is so crazy it's like you you ready to give up life and then the next day you actually want to live life and you want to live it to the fullest and and that's what God can do for you he did it for me and he could do it for you too you just gotta want it you just gotta want it you gotta cry out and you gotta believe it you gotta believe it even when your feelings is telling you don't believe it so that's the message I wanted to share. I really, really wanted to share it last night because I was in that moment and I wanted to share it in that moment. But because that moment was so special, I was like, this is something I got to put off. This, you know, I'll record it tomorrow. But yeah, so hopefully that touched you. Again, if you're going through something right now, you're going to get through it. You know what I mean? You're going to get through it. This is temporary. So yeah, that's all I have to say. And again, I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.